What's going on guys, Linus here. Welcome to Korean Emergency Simulator 6, uh, also known as Civ. Playing as the Netherlands, we are currently in an emergency with our friends Korea. Shaka is involved as well, he should be helping me out. But I guess he decided that he preferred having his army over here instead of actually doing anything. So, if we win, we still split the money with him, but he doesn't actually do anything. So this is just great. That's just beautiful. Um, now we're trying to liberate Kumasi, so we're at war with Korea. Things are going okay-ish, but we are slightly behind in science, and she has musket men running around, uh, which we, we do not. <clears throat> okay, we got a bunch of um, swordsmen, crossbowmen, we have a catapult soon uh, next to the city that will be ready to fire at it. I'm hoping that that will uh, turn the tide and help us actually take Kumasi, because if we don't do this, if we fail again, then we've ended up giving Korea so much money, which is definitely pretty bad. But for now, she seems to be not doing too hot, which is good. We need to, uh, to make sure this goes well. You go over there, keep shooting Kumasi, crossbows, go. Catapult is now set up, ready to go. All right, let's see. What are we going to do with this builder? Are we even working that hill? We are. Okay, so we might as well throw down a, um, a mine then. Improve production around here. Uh, we have a knight who is ready to go. We have a normal archer. We need more money to... Um, there you go. Get a pasture going. We need more money to upgrade all of our existing units. Because we have like a bunch of chariots. We have some normal bowmen. Which really isn't very good. That's not helping very much at all. So we need to weaken Korea somehow. She's too strong. I knew this was going to be an issue. And I think that losing the earlier emergency has only made her stronger. Because we ended up giving her like, I don't know, 4,000 gold. Either way, it was a lot of money. I will not make peace. How dare you even suggest such a thing. We need to do this now. We need to at least liberate Kumasi, win the emergency. Uh, but I like to take Carthage as well. We need to gain some ground here. We have a pretty small amount of land compared to others. We need to do better. And that's exactly what we're trying to do here. Uh, this city needs housing quite badly. Let's make a university. Again, science, we are behind and I, I don't like that very much. Moment of truth. Oh my god, okay. Well, Catapult doesn't help that much. Uh, the way I see it, we'll probably still end up taking Kumasi, but it will take forever to get this going. Didn't mean to talk to you, sorry. This is awkward. I was just about to kill some of your people. Alright, so what else should we do? We should probably make something there. This is a hill, no? Yes, it is. Alright, so we're just going to plop down another mine there. Alright, so the, this city now has a lot better production, and that's just great. Um, you're not really doing much. I guess you can just sort of stand by in case they want to try and attack me. That would be okay. We do need Valletta to get more involved. Like, currently they are keeping their distance. Which is, I get it, but that's not very helpful to me. Let's get a lumber mill here. Because we need to get at least one lumber mill to get, you know, a boost for uh, mass production. Alright, so at least soon we'll have a, a market going. Which is going to give us another, like, four, three, four gold per turn, which is at least it's something. Okay, the Spearman has suicided, which is great. So we will take uh, take Kumasi, I think, if the uh, the status quo here remains. But we're not doing too hot at all. Also, those walls are slaughtering my people. Okay, gold from quarries. That's pretty good as well. Let's get you out of there. You did your job. And it ended up not being enough. Um, we need promotions. I'm actually going to try and get incendiaries here. And see if that helps out with um, attacking these sort of city walls. They're not really walls. It's a garrison. But oh well. Alright, that was a good hit. The catapult is definitely better than the crossbowman. But really not by too much. So that definitely kind of sucks. Let's get gunpowder. Uh, thing is, we don't have a source of niter anywhere. So, how are we even going to get, you know... How are we going to get Musket Man? I honestly don't know. Got no idea. Uh, we should probably get a Lumber Mill going here as well. 
And then that builder will be all done. Let's farm the rice. That's going to be pretty beautiful. All right, so we got some good tiles around our new city of Eindhoven, but we can do better later. Uh, but it's a good start. It's a good enough start. Chandra Gupta, how about focusing on stuff that actually matters? Are you kidding me? Okay, now I don't know who just died. Oh, that was the Valletta archer. Immediately died. Didn't get to do anything whatsoever. And now that's yet another family without a dad. Okay, we're in the Dark Age now. Yay. That's just great. I mean... I don't like most of these, honestly. I guess I'll take the score for constructing districts. I don't think I'm going to be doing a lot of converting. Not really. I don't really see that happening. Then the one that gives you one for trait routes is like, that's okay. But you're not going to complete a lot of trait routes. So what's the point? Uh, plus three, every time you discover a new continent or natural wonder. If you're going to be doing a lot of exploring and you haven't explored a lot, sure. But we've already seen a lot of stuff. So I'm going to go with monumentality here. Even though it's really not that good. But that does mean that we are going to be able to, um, or we're going to have to really, uh, make more districts. And we're going to have to make them real good. Should we get a stupa? Maybe we should. We could get an encampment here. Actually, we're making one over there, so we probably should make another one. Harbor is an option. I like the campus. Like, plus four is great, but we've removed the rice. And I hate that because this is giving us a lot of food. So, I'm sorry, but I'm not doing that. Let's get a bank then. Let's just do that. Let's just improve our existing uh, district there. We're going to go heal you. All right, keep shooting, damn it. I refuse to fill this emergency. I will lose my entire army before I let that happen, okay? I cannot accept it. So, we're doing some good damage here. Catapult does do about twice the damage that a crossbowman does, so turns out catapults are pretty good. Yeah, what are we going to get here? We could just buy the tile. No, actually, we don't have money. I'm used to having a lot of money, if you can't tell. And now I don't. And I definitely do not like it. Although, I must say, I'm thankful for... Oh, wait, I should move the knight. Oh, boy. No. No. Oh, okay, we, we're at war with Armag. I thought that she maybe stole Valletta, but it looks like we're okay. Oh, actually, the knight has pretty great defenses. Look at that. Okay, good for you, man. Good for you. All right, keep shooting. Keep shooting. Never give up. If we give up, then that's going to be bad. So let's not do it. Like a lumber mill there. That's going to be slightly more production. We need housing in Rotterdam. Yeah, that city is growing a little bit too quickly for its own good. All right, so we are at war with our mag, uh, who is over there. That's going to be a problem because that means Shaka is at war with them as well. So Shaka is going to crush them unless he turns out to be super dumb, which I guess he already has been. You know, he's already proven himself to not be dependable or competent in any way. Again, buddy. You're supposed to be helping me. So finally he's moving some units, but the emergency is already half over. So he basically ended up taking a sweet time. He, he's making me do all the hard work, which is super rude. All right, just keep shooting. Don't get distracted by anything. We are taking Kumasi. Okay, we are liberating this thing. We almost got it. Actually, we might have it right now. Yep, we got it. All right. All right, so that's actually really good. That's a that's an emergency dealt with, looking good. And there's okay, we're gonna have a rebellion here. That sucks. However, we did do the emergency, so that's the thing. If we just liberate it, it'll be fine, right? It's liberated. I'm hoping. Come on now. Sure, I'll take a rider. That'd be cool. So now the whole um. Rebellion thing. I can't really you know, I can't really deal with that because I gave it back. So No longer my problem with my drink 
Drinking alone by moonlight. Beautiful. All right, so finally we have a piece of writing. That took a while. Got a mine there. All right, so this city is now set up. It's got pretty good food, pretty good production. All we gotta do is, you know, make sure that we keep, sort of keep sustaining it at least a bit. But it's looking good. Kumasi is liberated. Please tell me that's enough. Armag made peace again. Good for them because they would, probably would have been crushed by Shaka. Members are victorious. Honestly, I should have gotten all the gold, but sure, I guess we'll split it with Shaka. That's some error score for me. Catapult got an upgrade. I actually take that. Defense is pretty good. So Kumasi is full loyalty again, and we did a good job. They should now be... Yep, they're super thankful for my help. Which is great. Um, I guess we're going to try to move on to Carthage now. Because I'd like to make sure that Korea does not come back with a vengeance. Because that would obviously not go in my favor. As we've seen throughout this entire war. And the one preceding it. Um, let's see. I guess we should probably make like a barracks or a stable. Let's go barracks then. Alright, go, go, go. Make some more writing in the Great Library. In, this most in the mountains on a summer day. Yep. Well, at least we are the only people going after writers, which that's pretty good. And if we go after musicians, which we actually already are, but we need to make at least one more theater square. So that we can definitely permanently sort of take the lead there. I'm going to chop down the, uh, the marsh here. I'm not chopping it down, but, you know, clear it. Just so we can, um... I'm not making peace with you, you sucker. Get out of here. Get out of here, lady. Merchant Republic, baby. We finally got it. We're gonna grab it. This is giving us a lot of different slots. We want the, um... Maybe we should just go at one of these. Like, uh, I'm not really sure about that one, though. I don't really mean to make a new city right now, so we could actually use this one. Domestic trade routes become much more effective. At the same time, it's not like Twilight Valor is extra combat strength, but it's only melee attack units, so I feel like it's really not that good. And I would rather have more... Maybe great merchant points, maybe just rider points. Maybe... Um, Faster growth when not in your original continent. Like, we should probably use conscription. We need to get gain some money somewhere. Cavalry, naval, other units, basically. Honestly, a lot of these I don't really like too much. I guess we could just take, like, rider points. Sort of speed that up a bit. I don't think there's anything else that I really want right now, so we'll use that. But this is good. We have a new government. We almost have our normal age. We gained a bunch of era score for adopting a new beautiful government, so that's great. Let's get Divine Right going. We do need... Okay, so we have a lot of money now. That's definitely the upside of all this, is that we completed the emergency. I was going to say disaster, but yeah, emergency. Uh, so we can now safely do a bunch of stuff that would normally cost me a bunch of money. Let's get a trader going as well. We need to go after Carthage. I mean, we have to. Alright, go. 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 Luckily, uh, there are already some damage has been inflicted on these walls, but we obviously are going to need a lot more. Right, let's try to stay away from the uh, the walls. They already have watches, which are really, really scary. Yep, get that food going. Get that food going. And they actually don't have enough food to grow anymore, apparently. Or it's like bugging out. It is bugging out. Okay. Like it grew 14 turns ago or something. Alright, we got it though. It's cool. That's a definite no. I'm not trading away my great works of writing. I wanted to see if he was... Yeah, he's still war with Korea. If we can depend on him... For even a little bit, that would be so beautiful. Yeah, the Hawatches are really scary. What do they replace again? Not catapults, is it? It's just unique. High range detect strength, but it cannot move. It replaced a field cannon, so they already have field cannons, basically. 
This sucks. I hate this so much. Okay. Uh, we could destroy the sugar, but what do we really gain from that? Not much. We're just going to do as much damage as we possibly can and just pray that somehow we can liberate, or well, not liberate, but take Carthage. Uh, I feel like it's grown so much that we are much better off just taking it for ourselves as opposed to liberating it, so... That's just what I'm going to do. We do have some new units now that are actually capable of doing some damage here, so we're going to make good use of those. And we can actually change the uh, the policy that gives us cheaper promotion or upgrades now. Don't No longer need it. And I have a, a chunk of money remaining, which is beautiful. Oh boy, Catapult, please tell me you can, you can survive this because... Oh my god, dude. We need to take down that wall. If we take down the wall, it's going to be pretty easy taking the city. But the wall does need to go down. If the wall does not go down, then I don't really see how we're going to be successful here. Alright, so we got a um, new government. We can get rid of professional army now, so let's do this. Production towards cavalry units. I don't really want cavalry that much. I mean, maybe I should just take one of these. I guess we'll take isolationism for now. We'll see how that goes. Because that is a lot of food and that is a lot of production. Is this going to be enough to take down the walls? It actually might be. With the catapult's effort in there. Actually, it's not yet. But if you attack, it's going to be so close here. It's going to be so close here? Alright, just switch places, alright? And just hope that that's going to be okay. I think it should be, though. I think we might just be able to make it here. Uh, sure, diplomatic service is already boosted, so we should probably grab that. Catapult. Catapult, get out of my lands, my guy. You're not supposed to be here. Although I must say, it is very, very sweet of Korea to just give me a free, free settler. For no added cost, and I will gladly accept. Thank you. That's just beautiful. Took basically no damage. Question is, where are we going to use this guy? I guess we could use him down there, but what's the point? I'd rather sail over here, I guess, and go there. We have cartography. Not yet, actually. Okay, we should grab it, though. So we can make this crossing here. Claim that island for ourselves. Here we go. Catapult survives, right? Yep. Interestingly enough, she's getting really desperate for peas. She's offered me a lot of money. So I'm guessing that her army is just like really low right now. She's got very little going on in terms of army strength. We could use you. However, we could just shoot this guy and claim a free builder and destroy her apostle, which is actually pretty, pretty damn great. Turn down this wall. It's now or never. Carthage will be ours, and then we'll have more land. And I like having land. Alright, so we're going to steal the worker. Go, Sir Knight. Got him. Condemn the heretic, so that is less Buddhism all around, which is great. Uh, yeah, I think we are going to send the settler, I guess, closer to that island, and we'll see if that is an option. We don't really know right now, do we? Okay, this trader, I guess, is done. We don't... What I noticed earlier is that we don't have a... Well, actually, we do have a road gun here now. Okay, so that's good. We could trade with Patna. Which is their capital. That's a lot of money. It's production. It's a nice little road. Sure, let's get that going then. Alright, so we did this though. No longer do you have walls to protect your garbage people. Carthage will be mine. What's that? Unmet city state has been defeated. Okay. Kumasi made peace. Oh, that's bad. I need Kumasi for sure. Wait, did... How'd that happen? Korean city center. Oh, wait, that was like a tiny baby sliver left. Are you kidding me? That's not even fair. Like, they were dead. Well, there goes one catapult, but he did his duty, though. He did what he had to do. How did I lose? Like, I liberated these guys, and now they're like, Oh, Shaka's pretty good, too. Everybody's such a jerk. I don't like Siv. Alright, let's see. We should probably finish the stupa. 
But the amphitheater would be good for culture, it would give us great writer points, so we should probably do that instead. Uh, you go to Eindhoven, and then we'll trade with probably the capital. They desperately need a granary, like they really need housing. Alright, get your ass over here, you go back. Get the crossbowman over here. Alright, you go towards the island. We will take Carthage. I hope that nobody thinks I'm a warmonger, though. But I definitely feel like I've earned this. Alright, let's see. There's an emergency ongoing. We don't know who's involved, though. Let's get you a promotion. There you go. That's gonna be great. Fire. Fire. Now, we do want to take out the Spearman because he's actually capable of doing some damage to the knight. Uh, it'll probably be pretty manageable in terms of how much damage it'll be, but still. I'd like to not have that guy hanging around. What's going on, boys? Stuff's freezing up. I like to be able to get some pike and shot and some bombards. Alright. Um, step into the oasis and fire. There we go. Let's get you defense versus ranged attacks. I think that would be pretty good. There we go. Pretty beautiful stuff. All right, let's go, go, go. All right, we have our entire army surrounding Carthage. That'll be good. Look at the... Um, actually, this is pretty strong, I have to say. That's such a huge increase in what you're getting here. That's true with Maastricht. There we go. So that's great for Eindhoven. I mean, that, that'll be very helpful. We should probably get some spies soon as well. Oh, the deal is going way up. She is, she feels the pressure. She knows that she's about to lose. Amsterdam has grown, I guess, to, yep, 10 citizens, so that's good. We are about to enter a normal age. Which normally is not really something to be excited about, but following a dark age, I mean, that's quite nice. I kind of do want to grab the armory, but I think we should just grab um, some units to make us slightly stronger. Like, well, the pikeman's not really that good right now. I guess we're going to wait. So let's get the armory then. Make uh, Rotterdam into our nice military uh, city. Should we grab a farm here? Possibly. I guess for now we'll just do this. That'll be good enough. All right. So we have two archers from this side now as well. Meaning that Carthage is in real trouble. That is five crossmen firing away at your walls or your garrisons. It's not doing as much as I'd like, obviously. But we're trying. Yeah, we're going to need this catapult to be back pretty soon. Pretty soon. The knight could do some damage, but it would be quite bad. Also, we do need to get Kumasi back very soon. But they don't have a quest for me, so... I can't quite reclaim them right now. Oh, they made a builder. That makes sense. Obviously, you would you would like some nice farms surrounding your city walls if you are under attack. That only makes sense. That's... That's just common sense. Alright, let's get you volley. There we go. We're gonna get all the promotions that we can because that is gonna be helpful. When some of our units show up, which they will. I don't think, you know, this war is going to be quite slow, so... She's probably going to want to, want to, you know, go at it pretty hard. Let's get you over to um, Maastricht again, so that we can chop down the, the force over there. There you go. That dude's going to cross the ocean and see if we can settle this island. I'm hoping there's something good out there. Uh, Amsterdam is trading with Amsterdam. That makes no sense. Oh, wait. Okay, yeah. So we're trading. Okay, let's let's keep that up. That's a good trade route. Like, the internal trade routes right now are just really, really good. Because of that Dark Age policy. Downside is we can't get any settlers right now. A diplomat is a man who always remembers a woman's birthday, but never remembers her age. Okay, so pretty good stuff in here. I kind of like this one as well. This is a new one. Uh, Whistle Bunker. That gives you um, extra food production when you trade with an ally and your alliance points grow quicker, which is pretty good. Pretty good. I'm not going to use it right now because I feel like this alliance is like, eh. Is he actually helping me out? Not quite. 
you know. I mean, if he were a real bro, he would get involved in this. Let's get an embassy with him, though. Uh, he would get involved in this war. But we can't ask him to. We can't even, like, offer him anything to help me out. So that definitely kind of sucks. Um, sure, I'll take Reformed Church. Cross that ocean, my guy. Let's see what you can get going. Alright, fire away, boys. Fire away. Five crossmen eventually should be able to get through these... Through this garrison. But the catapult is, is ready for action again, so we're gonna have to get him back here. Yeah, we're doing damage enough to the city where, you know, it's we're, we're like doing more damage to it than it can currently heal. Uh, but we need to do better. We need to do more. We should also get more universities for sure. Because I'm sure that Korea is like blasting me out of the water. No, leave me alone. I'm not going to take your 61 gold per turn. I mean, that's a lot of money, I will admit, but I need more... I need more land. Alright, let's see. Oh, there's another little island out there. Right, we're going to chop this down. We're going to wait until Magnus is fully settled in before we do that. Fire. Fire. On the bright side, we're getting a lot of great experience on the crossbowman this way. And as long as they don't die, then it's absolutely going to be worth it. Alright, so let's get you out of there. Let's get the catapult in there, and that's going to make all the difference in the world to take this city nice and quickly. If we get the upgrade to Bombards... I mean, we do need Niter to actually do this, but if we get Niter somewhere, and we get the upgrade to Bombards, that's going to make uh, our little conquest so much better. Okay, so we're actually, we get the next scientist. And Korea will get the one after that. Merchant points, we're doing okay-ish, but we need to do better. Writer's going good. Ours is okay, but not quite enough yet. But the writers are, are pretty good. Although we do need to do better in culture. Okay, that's that's a lot of boosts. Until you've stood at his forge and worked with his hammer. That gives us the bombard. Which is going to be so, so good. But we don't have Niter, so what are you going to do about it? Alright, boys. Fire away. I mean, we should probably try to, like, officially... ...besiege this city. Which currently it's not. I think you have to surround it basically as much as you possibly can. Okay, this, the knights do a lot of damage. I think we could take it this turn, but we would take a lot of damage to, uh... Every melee unit involved, so I guess we're gonna wait one more turn before we uh, officially do this. We could get castles. I want to get cartography, though. Definitely want to explore more of the oceans. There are still players out there that we've not met, and I would like to meet pretty much everybody in the game. That would be really nice. Honestly, a harbor might be okay. Don't really need more builders right now. So we really just got to determine what district we would like. We don't have a lot of harbors. I think we actually have none. So we could grab one of those for sure. At the same time, I'd like another theater square. If that's sort of our... You know, strategy that we're looking at is to go for culture, then we would need more of it. At the same time, an aqueduct is going to be very nice. So let's actually grab an aqueduct and get the uh, the housing that we're going to need. Okay. Yeah, you can't do much, buddy. I'm sorry. Two more turns till we chop that down. Alright. Oh, that's scary. You can't grab me like this, though. There's Niter out there, which is very good. Here we go. Boost for industrialization and chemistry. I'm seeing Niter, and that alone makes me interested in actually settling this island. I feel like... I'm seeing floodplains as well. We, we do need some military unit, though, to join our settler out there, make sure he's okay. Um, sure, that's good. Let's fire. Honestly, I probably should have considered it whether or not we can even take the city before I got that promotion, but they got a musket man in there that is providing more garrison, but he's doing, like, very, very little in terms of actual um, attack, which is good for us. So I'm going to just accept that. All right, well, we can't take it, and I actually will take it here. Go, Sir Knight. 
There you go. And then I think there's possibly the Swordsman. Yeah, let's have the Swordsman finish it. That's Carthage, baby. We got it. We got that in the bag. We also got one of their builders. Let's fix up the monument. We need to make sure that loyalty stays nice and high. Currently, it's it's looking good. Uh, but it's, it's rising ever so slowly. So having a monument is obviously going to be pretty good. I'm going to keep the city. Which is going to give me a bit of a warmonger penalty, but I hope it's not too much. No, it's okay. At least it seems to be okay for now. Uh, let's make... Let's see. I'm actually leaning towards something like... Well, we can't make a swordsman right now. Let's make a crossbowman, maybe. Send him with the settler. Make sure that, you know, he's safe and all that. Really would prefer not to lose my settler, but this seems decent enough to settle. Like, there's some floodplains. That's just about it, but there's niter, and I do need niter. Nope, no deal. Definitely no deal. All right, this is dangerous stuff. Okay, we actually, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. We are going to settle there. All right, look, what are we gonna, what are we gonna make? Actually, Aqueduct would be really good. So let's get rid of the farm. Sorry, farm. But you're out of here. Boom. Aqueduct done. Just like that. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that a thing of beauty? Let's do this. It didn't add a lot of housing, obviously. But it should have added something, at least. Well, let's make some farms or something. Let's just enjoy our new city that we just got. So Jinju actually has, like, much worse defense than the city that we just took. So I think that'll be our next target. Like, we do want to push Korea back sufficiently that she's, like, at least weakened somewhat. So if we take Jinju, that'll be pretty good. And that'll leave her with a pretty small amount of cities. And that's going to give me a lot more land. We're allied to Chandragupta, so I don't think I can do much wrong in his eyes. Even she doesn't, she's not like worried about warmongering because that's a city that, you know, she took. So, like that used to be a free city state. So we just li sort of liberated it to our own cause. So it's not that bad. All right. Anyway, guys, I'm actually going to leave you here for now. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider dropping a like. And I'm going to talk to you in the next part where we settle, hopefully, a city out of here. Get some nice wine, some niter, upgrade our catapult to a bombard and try to destroy Korea some more. So thanks for watching. And I'll talk to you later.